Well, it's Monday, October the 11th. If you're in Canada, happy Thanksgiving. If you're in the U.S., well, your time's coming. In this episode, we are going to show you the start to finish build series of my dream shop. Uh, it's been something that's been coming for a long time now, and uh, this is only going to be part one. But uh, I hope you enjoy it. If you're not yet subscribed, go ahead and click that red subscribe button down below the screen. That way you can get updated every time I go live or upload a new video. Guys, stay tuned, because once this garage is built, we're going to have lots of projects to work on. There we have it, folks, the first scraping, getting rid of that topsoil. So far, everything looks good. Uh, pulling the topsoil off here, a little bit of clay under there, uh, but it seems like it's a good solid base, they say, so we're gonna build her up uh, with some pit run, probably about a foot, and uh, they're taking all this good topsoil and we're able to reuse it. Bring it up along the side of the house over there, we'll be able to plant some grass in there. And, we got a little bit of a ditch going here because water does build up in back here. Keep that flowing. Anyways, looking good so far. Day, the machinery has quieted down and we've got ourselves a nice big pad for our 32 by 50 garage and then as we come around here we've also got our new driveway installed and it's all been compacted with the roller and we can't wait to drive on it all we got left to deal with is some landscaping and some mud Well, good morning, guys. Today is concrete pour day. As you can see, we've got the concrete truck behind me. And they were here bright and early. But it is a cool morning for doing concrete. It's only about uh, four degrees uh, Celsius. That's 41 degrees Fahrenheit. Let's take a look and see what we're doing. Hey, Bob. Huh? You see it, it's 100 days on the <laughs> So it's not even eight o'clock in the morning yet and uh, they've got one truck unloaded and they're anticipating probably, I think she said uh, 30 yards all together. So what's that? Four trucks, maybe four and a bit. So anyways, we've got some time lapse going on them over there as well. So I'll insert that now and you guys can see how things are coming along.
there's truck number four in the waiting. So we'll see how they're making out. Well guys, I don't know where we left off since the last time we spoke, but today is Friday. It's the day before Canadian Thanksgiving, October the 8th, I guess. And well, I got a buddy coming over and we're gonna get all four walls erected today and hopefully get some trusses up uh, on the roof or what would be the roof. Um, as you can see, we've got the back wall done. We've got one little window over here where my workbench is gonna be. So like I said, the object today is to get this end wall finished up over here build this end wall where our man door is going to be and then we can come around to the front and start building up our garage doors and headers and stuff like that once we get it all built you guys will be able to see a little bit better how things are coming together and the kind of plan that we're going for but I want to give you guys the opportunity to take a look and see just exactly what this garage is going to look for. I'm going to insert a little animation right here. So I hope that explains it a little bit better for you guys. Uh, as of right now, we're also going to be pulling in here any minute. We're going to have a quick coffee, and then we're going to get started. So I'm going to set up a time lapse, and you guys can keep an eye on how we're doing. Well, we're slowly making some progress. Uh, we got this 16 foot section uh, built and put up. And then we came over here and we got this other one that we got a frame in a window. And this one here, we're getting ready to start doing right now. Again, we're framing in a window. So that's what's slowing us down. And that wind is just bowing this out like crazy. So I'm just gonna stand here and hold on to this until Ross gets back and we'll put some more bracing on it. Probably a good idea. Anyways. Back to some more time lapse, we'll get these walls built. All right, well, it's been a long, hard day. My back is spent, but we've got four walls up and uh, pretty much we're ready for rafters. So that's kind of the next thing here is to get those trusses installed up on top. And uh, then we can start getting some roofing on and closing it in. So that's where we left off today give you a little bit of a walk around so you can see what's going on got two windows on this side with the door a window over here and two grass doors so stay tuned we'll be right back and there you have it that is it that's where we are to date uh, in the next video, we'll be gonna, we're going to be doing trusses and hopefully get the uh, metal roof on. And uh, once that's done, we can start working away at the siding as well. So uh, I hope you enjoyed this build series. This is only part one. There'll probably be part two, maybe even a part three. 
and uh, we'll keep it going with some good time lapse and keeping you guys up to date with everything that's going on with my dream build shop. Once again, if you're not subscribed, go ahead and click that subscribe button. We're on our way to 10,000 subscribers. And when we get there, I'm going to do something special for you guys. We're giving away a huge prize package, courtesy of all the sponsors who have ever lended me a hand uh, on this channel and uh, they've all come through with something a little bit special so stay tuned for that we'll be doing a big drawing uh 10k t-shirts will be available very very soon i hope you guys can uh, help support the channel in other ways like buying those 10k t-shirts the dale the truck t as well as the original ocg t-shirt guys stay focused on the windshield not the rearview mirror i love you guys god bless let's do it again real soon